first blessings to all happy Martin Luther King Jr. Observance Day. On behalf of the African Burial Ground National Monument, welcome to hallowed and sacred ground. There are estimated to be 15,000 enslaved and freed Africans, men, women, and children buried in a cemetery that dates back to the 1690s. You see, this African burial ground rewrites history. For hundreds of years, people were taught that slavery existed in the South, on those plantations, Georgia, South Carolina, etc. Enslaved people were escaping and coming to the North where they were granted their freedom. But that was not the case. As slavery would exist here in New York City for more than 200 years, New York was built on the back of slave labor. Today, the National Park Service African Burial Ground National Monument joins your efforts in commemorating the work of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. as he stood for the rights of all mankind, as we strive together for equality and justice, imperative important that we keep the dream alive. I come and ask permission that these children who carry the legacy of our ancestors through the bloodline of humankind, the greatest crime ever committed against the people has been the transatlantic ocean of the slave trade. Bring a healing to all of us who witnessed this ceremony today in the spirit of our ancestor, Dr. Martin Luther King. We're gonna move to the Federal Reserve Bank as a symbol of the economic inequality in our society. Somewhere I read of the freedom of assembly. Somewhere I read of the freedom of assembly. Somewhere I read of the freedom of speech. Somewhere I read of the freedom of speech. Somewhere I read of the freedom of the press. Somewhere I read of the freedom of the press. Somewhere I read that the greatness of America. Somewhere I read that the greatness of America is the right to protest for right. Is the right to protest for right. And so just as I say, so just as I say. We aren't going to let dogs or water hoses. We aren't going to let dogs or water hoses turn us around. Turn us around. We aren't going to let any injunction. We aren't going to let any injunction turn us around. Turn us around. We are going on. We are going on. We need all of you. We need all of you. Only when it is dark enough. Only when it is dark enough. Can you see the stars? Can you see the stars? Something is happening in our world. Something's happening in our world. The masses of people are rising up. The masses of people are rising up. And wherever they are assembled today, and wherever they are assembled today, the cry is always the same. The cry is always the same. We want to be free. We want to be free. We're here at the Federal Reserve Bank. We're here because the Federal Reserve Bank represents income inequality, represents economic injustice, represents economic inequality. That's why we're here. Occupy Wall Street. Occupy the dream. The dream of Martin Luther King Jr. was a dream of economic equality, was a dream of racial equality, was a dream of all brothers and sisters coming together to make life better. Ain't gonna let nobody turn me around, turn me around, turn me around, ain't gonna let nobody Turn me around, I'm gonna keep, keep on, on rocking, keep, keep on talking, marching, marching in the freedom, freedom man.